Hi, good morning, so Hi, morning. So today we are meeting again for our NPI live. Yeah. So we have quite a bunch of new product today. So oh, today a bit noisy over here. Uh, some works are going on. <laughs> so today will be two of us, right? Yeah, only today. Yeah, today only two of us. So. Atira is not available today, so Atira um, available yeah. on on the viewer. On the view, oh, okay. the viewer, yes. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, she commented. <laughs> uh, good morning, good morning, Atira. <laughs> morning, morning. Okay, so okay, today we have quite a number of new product to introduce today. So for the first, 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 we just want to just go through, not not go through. Actually, we want to see what are the products will be. Uh, we want to introduce today. So the first product is the. Let me just need to zoom in a bit. Okay. So the first product will be the acrylic set top box kit. Then we will. Oops. Then we will see the mini tower kit for Raspberry Pi. Uh, retro flag. I think over has the product. The retro flag Raspberry. Uh, Groove E5 Loravan. Then we have the. I think I just zoom on Obel first so that we can see the Obel product. Okay, we have the Laura one. Uh, then we have the Raspberry Pi hat. Or uh, I, the it, one is with me. You changed you change to. Uh, the one is with me. Uh, let me show. Uh, later we'll do the unboxing here. Yeah, you changed the. Uh, yeah, yeah just open the camera first. Oh, it's with me. Okay. So this is the groove. Ah, okay. Groove. Then we have the uh, Groove. Uh, hold on. Eh? The Moto also with me. The Groove Compact Servo. Groove mm. Compact Servo. Then we have the Groove SIM GPS, uh, SIM 28 GPS receiver. Then we have the, let me change the product. Okay. Yep. Then we have the OLED display. Oh, OLED is with me. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. okay. well, we have a viewer saying morning. So morning, Ahmad. No, Kade. Uh, morning. Morning, morning. Okay. So we have the next. We have the DIY stem walking brushes set. Brachiosaurus. Brachiosaurus. <laughs> then we have yeah, another DIY one. kit stem walking. This is Brachiosaurus. Tricep, Rattos. Ah. Yeah. They, I think when they, they name it, it <laughs> it's kind of uh, all this dinosaur. <laughs> Sorry. And then we have these uh printers. Uh, we have some uh, quite quite I think three three printers, if I'm three, mistaken. Three printers. Yeah. Three printers we want to introduce. Okay. The and the three and the two pro and two pro. Uh, and the three S1. S1. And as well as the sermon. 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 Uh, salmon or salmon <laughs> moon yeah, so laura we have another laura one laura laura sorry laura not laura one laura uh antenna please antenna. antenna yeah uh, but also, this one's so out already uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's too fast and also uh a 3d scanner ah uh, 3d scanner i need oh, to open the uh, window oh, I, think, uh, I have the box already oh quite big eh? i thought it's yeah. <laughs> No, the, the box is big, uh, but I, I don't think I can open it uh, because it's sealed. So I, I just oh, okay. I will show, uh, later show the we'll box. Show, uh, okay. show the box on it. <laughs> All right. Oh. So that's are the products so that we will be uh, going through for today. So yeah. so let's start with our first product for today. So this is the acrylic set top box kit for Raspberry Pi 4B. This is a transparent box actually. Yep. Uh, so let's. Uh, what I like about it is because it, it has an expansion and a side expansion, it will actually expand the, all the connector to oh, one side. Okay. So no, normally, you, you know, the HDMI and also the power is okay. at the side. So this uh, set, uh, setup box is not only the case, but it comes with a PCB. Oh, comes... oh okay, okay. Uh, extra PCB. Extra so PCB. You, yeah, you need to uh, plug in. 
uh, to the HDMI mm. and so you have okay, to see yeah. Ah, yeah, 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 this, uh, this one. Yeah. Okay. And it also extends to another USB 2, 2 uh, port lah, at the back there. Uh -huh. At the back. Okay, this one maybe the other side they are showing. So it's it's kind of easy, you know, tidy when you want to use uh you know cabling all those, it becomes very tidy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So no need to worry about how you want to do the cabling on I mean it's already in the one yeah, yeah. one box. So I think the instructions here are clear uh, how how you can yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the... how to assemble it. Assemble. Uh, I think it's very clear. Uh, you know, everyone can be everyone, yeah. can, can can do it, uh, no problem. The, the, no the steps are very very clear now, uh, very clear. Yeah. Oh, so you don't need, you don't only get the case, you only also get an extra USB port as well. Uh, two USB yeah. port as well. Yeah. Just just to yeah. remind because it, it changed the micro HDMI to full size HDMI or the standard size HDMI. So mm -hmm. just uh just remind on that. Uh, because it's convenient uh, some, also. Yeah, it's convenient. Mm -hmm. it's, it's more common, right? <laughs> more common, yeah, it's more common, correct. <laughs> I think we have viewer one say good morning. Hi Rail. I didn't. <laughs> okay, all right. So these are the packing list. You will get this the item inside the box. is a one transparent acrylic case, uh transfer interface. This is the board line, interface transfer PCB board, uh 40 transparent blue light fan, screw, and etc. The products. And for other resources, I mean if you want to see the video, uh it's here. So you always come to the bottom of the page to see the uh the on the resources and the, these are some of the people who have assembled it as so you can watch the video here okay so the the price for the for this product is uh 79 ringgit and uh with the 20 percent off you can grab this at 63 ringgit and 20 cents and on top of that you can have a discount the NPI discount. Uh, yeah, uh, NPI discount. discount. Okay. So, oh, at the, at the bottom, right? So it's ah, already just uh, scrolling. Yeah. Yeah. So you can grab this. So we have for the first ten early birds, you'll get the you're, you're able to buy this uh, with additional discounts, right? So hmm. try to grab this. So currently we have forty eight in stocks, and this offer will expire in uh, one day. So try to grab it before. It's, it's gone all right so let's move to the next product for today so this is the uh, this mini one. tower kit for raspberry pi for okay. model b right so okay. Ober has the product so let all about yeah. Ober will show the product all right so uh, uh, this is from or uh directly from 52 pi i think uh this is actually created or designed by uh one of the maker it's very famous. He liked to design a desktop kind of case for Raspberry Pi. And he have a lot of version. So this, this version is the basic one. So where, where you have the uh, ice tower cooling. So you don't worry about the overheating. Uh. overheating. And it become a you know a mini desktop PC. Desktop. Uh, right. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it's cool, cool. cool. Looks cool also. Yeah, yeah. Then uh let me see uh, if I can power it up. Uh, I think there is lighting also. There's some lighting. Yeah, the, the fan oh, okay, comes with some lighting. So it's like yeah. RGB, RGB lighting. Yes. Yeah. So that uh then there is also a what the OLED OLED come with the OLED. So later we we'll look at the uh, packing list uh, and there's a video teaching how to assemble it. Then you can also access the SD card at the back. Okay. So all the port you can also access uh, uh, USB Type C, uh, micro HDMI, the audio jack, and of course the fun is the Ethernet and also Ethernet and also the USB. The USB uh, yeah, and the top oh. there's an OLED. OLED. OLED usually dis display like the performance. I mean the heating, the CPU the, if, usage. Yeah, CPU usage, the memory, oh, the yeah. temperature maybe. Uh -huh. uh, you need to install the driver lah. So. Mm -hmm. So if you look at the pin, so some of the pin is actually connected to OLED, then some is connected to the uh, ice tower awesome. for the fan. Yeah. Uh -huh. So th there's a lot of uh, modification on this. There's a lot of version. Uh, this is the basic one, and he also extend the GPIO to mm -hmm. right angle, 
uh, oh okay so it's convenient uh, to access the ah, supplier so it's convenient yeah. so it come with a pcb uh. yeah mm -hmm. Yep. You have comment from Idris. Oh, cute PC. <laughs> Idris, you can print it. <laughs> so, just to highlight, this this part is actually 3D printed parts, huh? Oh. So this is acrylic. Yes. Acrylic. Yeah. Not 3D printed, yes. huh? The part. Yes, this is uh, oh. 3D printed. So the blue color part is actually mm. 3D printed. Okay. And the side, this two side is actually uh, the acrylic. Acrylic. We cut acrylic. So this mm. is hard. It's like honeycomb. Yeah. Honey. Oh, okay. Cool. The hexa, hexa. Oops. Yeah. Okay. So let's let's see uh more details on this product. Okay. So it's a three D printed case. Oh, like over mentioned, yeah. it's a three D printed case kit with Raspberry Pi three, three B plus, and four B. And right. So let's see if they show. Okay. These are the instructions. So it's clearly mentioned now. How what how what is the installation steps? I mean, from the, but I mean, how you should get it connected, and these are the video lah. Uh, it's a, yeah, one of the video, one of the video. video. To see how it's, it's, I mean, how to install at the tower. Okay, so these are the features. It's easy to install, pretty outlook, compatible with Raspberry Pi. It comes with 0 0.9, 0 0.96 inch uh, OLED display, it's a laser cut acrylic cover, and it's compatible with both Ice Tower and low profile Ice Tower. Okay, these are the items the you will get, uh, parts uh, you will receive when you bought, buy this item. And also for the resources, you can come down here and you can have a look I mean, to know more about the product. It's a wiki page there. And the price for this product uh, is 229 ringgit. Uh, currently, we are giving 20% uh, off for this. And you can grab this product at 130, 183 ringgit and 20 cents. And on top of that, you can apply the NPI discount, which can you can up get up to 15 ringgit max discount for this. Uh, so try to grab this because we only have six units at the moment. So try yep. to grab this before it's gone. Right. So that's about the mini tower. Right. So let's move to the third product for today. Which is the uh, retro flag. So this is for, flag. The, for gamers. Ah, <laughs> uh, this is quite new. It's like unboxing already. Okay. Yeah. So this is for. I think what's the name of the game already or the the console? I'm not sure. Like not not Nintendo, Nintendo. right? Nintendo. I'm not sure. <laughs> not sure. So this is the case. Okay. I think Nespi, I think behind that they mentioned the Nespi, right? Nes not Nespi, no. Nash Nash Pi or Nash. Nash Pi. No, obviously both of us don't play game, right? <laughs> <laughs> so maybe some of the viewer know. No, no, the name. Uh. No, it, it comes with uh, what what they call it, uh, this cartridge. 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 Uh, but cartridge. this cartridge is for you to put uh SSD. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> Two point five in SSD. SSD. So that if you can see that is a starter slot inside there, so it's oh. actually compatible with. So you can put your game, uh, you know, uh, if you install RetroPie, all the image, the game image. Uh, then let me see. I think it should come with some of the uh, assembly guide. So inside there, there's a manual. Mm -hmm. Yeah, how to assemble. Uh, there's also some parts. Uh, let me see. Oh, okay. Oh okay. Uh, this is oh, the top lid. okay. Uh, okay, so you can see that it's a USB three. Uh, I cannot I can remember what what's this called. This is white white USB. So this is USB 3.0. So this is connected to the SSD that SSD. I mentioned. Ah oh, okay. Yeah, from this side. Okay. And then you have some of the parts, the screwdriver, the screw. And you install your Pi 4 over here, I think. Yeah. Pi 4 mm -hmm. over here. Oh, the internet is extended out. I'm not sure you can see. If you can see, I cannot see. So that's a part. So you still have the internet. Where is the internet actually? Oh, it's connected to some place else. The internet. Oh, there's a button over here. This button is push lock. Push unlock. Very nice. 
Oh, this is power, this is reset. Then what else? Oh, very nice, huh? This one. So that's the retro. And we also extend two USB to the front here. To, oh, okay. Okay. Then, oh, okay. So I think the instruction, the assembly guide should be inside the product page. Huh? It's nice, huh? Hmm. Oh, it extends out the internet to the back. The internet, oh, okay. Internet to the back. Mm -hmm. So the power and internet at the back. So it, it looks tidy. Lah. Right. Then your Pi 4 HDMI and also audio is from here. Once we install the Raspberry Pi, the visible then, I mean the ports. Yeah, the ports. Yeah. So this HDMI, micro HDMI, and also mm -hmm. the audio jack. Then the SD card access to here. Okay, so I think we can see a look at the product page. Product page, uh, sure. Yeah. Okay, so this is the product page for the retro flag. So actually, this is like like bringing in the nostalgia. I mean, you, you love playing this game <laughs> during the, those yeah, time, yeah. right? So, like but but this this version doesn't come with this this uh what at uh, the top uh. this is actually additional oh okay. just to make sure <laughs> okay <laughs> <laughs> oh, because because this this is the playstation one <laughs> ah, I, think uh, this, then... I think this is the original playstation one or the oh, national okay. five station <laughs> five station oh. All right so like over has explained just now so these are the i mean basically the description on the Ports and everything, and hmm. so it's slightly different showing here. But it's okay, but, but basically it's a, a console. I mean, it's a console game basic. Lah. So these are the features of the product. As for example, for Raspberry Pi Four, it's a dual USB port. Uh, on the front controllers, it's, it's a, it has a safe shutdown and safe reset button, so no need to worry on that. And it's a micro SD card on the micro SD card slot on the side. So these are the packing list and also the resources are uh, here for the retro flag pie case. And currently the, the price for the product is 120 ringgit. Uh, we are giving 20% off for this for this product. So it will be you can grab this at uh, 96 ringgit. So this offer uh valid for another 11 more days so you can try to grab it before it's gone on top of that you can apply the uh npi discount uh coupon code as well for this uh you can get additional discount on that so currently we have 20 in stocks and try to grab it before it's gone so let's move to the next product for today so this is a communication it's a group E5 LoRa 1 STM32 WLE 5JC module AS923. Where so, is it? Let me grab it and show it to you guys. So it's it. a Sit Sit Studio from Sit Studio. Right, I think Ober has it. So let's. Uh, it's Ober. very it's very small only, you know, very small. So this is the group connector lah. So it comes with the group connector. And it come with the wire antenna here. Okay. Mm -hmm. So the module is this one, and the communication is through UART. UART. Okay. Oh. Yeah. And you have an option to connect to U.FL, but I'm I think you you need to desolder something, you know, to connect to the external it's... antenna. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Not sure you can see it. Uh. It's visible, but not so clear. But, but we can see it. Uh. I mean, the, the shape is visible. Yeah. Uh. yeah. So I think the, the inside the product page, there is uh, one of our viewer, one of our makers, you know, community, CDEC, uh, use mm -hmm. this to do a point to point LOLA communication uh, okay. inside the product page. Okay, uh, so there's a video. Let's... Yeah, there's a video. Thanks to CDEC. I'm not sure CD is uh, on this live or not. Ah, ni. Oh, this one. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, so he's, he's doing point to point. 
P to P. Oh, P to P communication. Oh, okay, P to P communication. Oh, Sidi is here. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> so he said. Thanks, Sidi. So we actually use your, you know, your content in the product page. Uh, very nice work. Right. Okay. So I think we have few. I think one, one more mic. We didn't miss this one. One more mic. Akil. So you say good morning to us. Good so morning. Morning. Good morning. Right. So this. I mean, you can come to this product page and to see how how uh, this has been done. I mean, for the P two P communication using the uh, Groove uh, Groove Laura one. Right. So here are the spec. So basically, when it comes to Groove, it's always uh, easy like, in terms of connecting it to the hardware because. You only require the groove cable and it will be connected to your uh, any device either Arduino or Raspberry Pi. So you can always come here to the product page and to see how uh, CD has done it. And also on the uh, these are the features of the board actually, the LoRa one. It support LoRa one protocol on EU868, uh, US915 and AS923 frequency band. It's an ultra long transmitting range up to 10 kilometer. And easy to control AT command via, as has been mentioned by Ober just now, it's a UART connection. So yeah. it support on both platform, Arduino and Raspberry Pi as well. So you can come down here to know more about the spec of this board and also uh, resources uh, or get some sample codes and to know more about the circuit and the data sheet of the device. Right. So that's about the LoRa one. Okay. The price for this product is. Uh, 89 ringgit. Uh, really no discount on this. Finish already, I finish. Already, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but we, you, you can still get the, you know, the MPI, right? The MPI code. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, so code. the MPI code is still valid. So you can try to grab uh, MPI code. So I think CD has something to say. Thanks for featuring me in new episode 21 for the details, the exploration. <laughs> so, looking forward, uh, looking forward. Uh, uh, so maybe, maybe later we can update the new video in our page as well. Yeah, just, just share inside the group. Yeah. So we always uh, appreciate those content. Yeah. Right. So that's about uh, Laura One. Okay, now let's move to the next product, uh, which is the Groove uh, Head Groove Base for Raspberry Pi. The one is with me. Uh, let me... Oops. I want to open my camera. Okay. Oh, it's not so clear. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so this is the groove uh, base. Uh, hack. This is with me. So I just want to show. So this one comes with the. Uh, it's a head. Uh, head. Uh, sorry, head. Uh, base. It's a head base. Okay. So you will receive a board. Also, it comes with the uh, header screw. Lah. The header. So you can mount it on top of the uh, Raspberry Pi. This one I'm using a Raspberry Pi 3, so it's compatible. So you can just uh, plug it on top of here and it should be okay. Oh, right? it, it, it still extend out the GPIO, right? Ah, they still expand on, on top of here. You still have access hmm. to the GPIO. So, uh, so oh, you don't, you, you have the groove. So let me just to point here. So you have the PWM here, PWM, you have the digital, D5, D6, D18, and you have the UART here for the UART, and D22, D24, D26, this is for the analog, A4, A6, and you have three I2C uh, connectors lah here, you have three connect I, I2C connectors here, and you also have additional here for additional pins here, if it is visible to you. Uh, there's few, I mean, there are two slots here for the Raspberry Pi and the MCU. Later, we will uh, look in the product page for details. And also, you have the, for the cable, the, for the ribbon cable slot, you have the ribbon cable slot here. If you want to bring it up for other 
connection or what. So now let's look at the uh, product page. Okay, now let's look at the product page. So this is uh, how I showed just now. So, okay, this Raspberry Pi not included, just the head, uh, head only. So as I have shown just now, these are the uh, the groove connectors, type of groove connectors you will get. So you have the PWM, you have the digital, uh, you have the four, you have four, uh, six digital and four analogs and three I2C connectors. And here is mentioned here, uh, the what I have mentioned just now. And these are the, okay, this, the pinout are same as the Raspberry Pi, so it doesn't change the pinout. So whatever we declare, it should be the same. And also for the uh, others mentioned here, uh, for the PWM, UART, and the digital, so it is mentioned here. And also for the analog I2C and SWD. So SWD is the, we use, to, we use the SW port to burn the firmware to this head. Uh, so in addition, you can see three, so these are the additional, the additional one on here. So this part, this part, this part here for the SWD. So, okay, these are the futures. Uh, it support Raspberry Pi, or it support from 2B actually, 2B, 3B, 3B plus, and of course the Raspberry Pi 4. It has a built-in MCU. It has a 12-bit ADC. It's a multi-type groove port. Uh, so you have quite a number of uh, groove port there. It operates on 3.3 volts. And it's using the MCU. The MCU has the bottom, as you have seen just now. This is the MCU. So the MCU is using the STM32 or MM32. It's an ADC 12-bit. Okay. It's a groove. So you have, you, these are the ports, actually, you'll get. Six digital, four analog, three I2C, one PWM, and one UI. So there is, uh, the communication between the groove and the groove head and also the the our Raspberry Pi is done through the I2C bus now basically. So the I2C bus address also uh, mentioned here. It's a uh, zero times a uh, zero hex hex and zero times zero eight. So these are the products. So you can always come to the product page and come to the bottom for the resources here uh, to know how you can get started using this Raspberry Pi, uh, the Raspberry Pi with the uh, hat. And also uh, some of the design files, the schematics, the firmware, how you can update the firmware, and some uh, examples are uh, mentioned here. Right. So the price for this product is 55 ringgit, and currently we are giving 20% off for this product as well. So you can grab this at 44 ringgit. On top of this, you can apply the NPI code. You're, you're fast enough. You can apply the NPI code as well to get an uh, additional discount on top of this, right? So yeah, you, that's... You need to be fast because okay. left one only. Left one. <laughs> oh yeah, the unit left one only, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so try to grab it fast. So, but because I mean, we will restock if it's gone, but then it'll take time to restock. So better to grab it while, while the stock lasts. Okay, so the offer ends in four days more. So try to grab it because since the unit is very, very limited, it's one only we have currently. So try to grab this. Okay, so let's move to the next product for today. Okay, so this is a Groove, a Groove product as well. This is a Groove Compact RC Servo 1.8. So the product is uh, with me. Let me show the product. Okay. So the product is with me. Uh, uh, this is the... Uh, servo directly terminated by groove connector. Groove connector. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wait. Directly share my screen. So this one more like a MG ninety ninety size, uh, the size of the servo. So this one, as you can see here, it's mentioned here. I mean, this is basically a, 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 like normal normal the MG nineteen spec, uh, basically. Uh, so it's run on 4.6 and 6.6 6 .6 foot. And I uh, mentioned here, I mean, the spec are pretty much similar, lah, basically. You can see in the product page later. So it's quite easy, I mean, to access the servo because usually we need to read separate or we need to have a different connector, right? But this one, we use the, just use the digital pin. And I'm using uh, this, uh, the make, 
the roof nano base to oh, okay. program it. Yeah. So this one I already burned the program. We can get the sample code from from the from the uh, from our resources as well. So this I'm just gonna power it up and it should be running. So let me power it up. So as you oh, can see easy. here, you know, the very is, is very yeah, very easy. Very easy. Yeah. So no need yeah. to think about the policy. I mean, just plug it to the groove and make sure that you define the port number correctly in the in the in the in the software. Either I in the Arduino or the Raspberry Pi, then it should be running. So that's about the servo. So let's look at the product page. Let's look at the product page. Okay. So this is the servo. Okay, so DC Groove Servo is a DC motor with gearing and feedback system. Very mechanism of robot. Okay, basically servo mostly we use it in the robots now, basically. So this is the, the difference is usually we have a like three three wire connectors for servo since this is a groove type. So it comes with four, but still it uses three wire only. The four is just the, for the connector basic now, for the connect connector base. Okay, so this is a small module. It's a groove compatible interface with groove connector. It's easy to use and it supports both the platform, uh, Arduino or Raspberry Pi. And this can be mounted on the, the previously with the head, Raspberry Pi head is compatible with the Raspberry Pi head as well as since it's using the groove connector. So the working work, the Working voltage is 4.8 volt and the typical is 5 volt basically. All right, and these are the some spec of the motor as I uh, the the specs like basically the torque, the operating speed, and the stall torque. You can always come here and try to see what are the things mentioned here. And right, so that's about the product. And I always come here for the resources. You can see to know more about details of this. You can always come here. So the price for this product is 39 ringgit. Currently, we are giving 20% off as well for this product. And you can grab this for 31 ringgit and 20 cents. On top of this, you can apply the NPI code as well. At the bottom there, you can use the NPI code to get an additional discount for this. And currently, we have 16 in stocks. And the off this offer will, it, uh, will expire in uh, six more days. So try to grab this before it's gone. Okay. Right. So that's about the Groove Compact RC Servo. So let's move to the next product for today. This is the Groove SIM28 GPS receiver. So this is a GPS Groove module, basically. So, all right. Over one, do you have, you have the product with you? Over no. No, I don't have this one. Okay. All right. So, yeah. so, okay. So this is basically this is a GPS. Uh, it's a Groove groove based module and groove groove based module, so yeah. you can see here uh, it's a it's using SIM twenty eight uh, SIM twenty eight GPS receiver. Right, so let's see. So the groove is a cost efficient. Okay, okay, basically this is a group in uh, using the SIM twenty eight and a basic group uh, GPS uh, function, right? Yeah. So you can always come to the product page here and see how the the I spec. Yeah, the antenna. Oh, it's very nice. This is like an ex 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 external antenna, right? Yep, yep, yep. Uh, but most likely it's cer ceramic. Lah. So no, normally, you know, GPS come with a very big, chunky antenna on top of the GPS. Mm. Uh, so this is ex external. A uh, GPS, I think GPS, a lot of people uh, make a mistake. Lah. So they, they always uh, put GPS indoor when they do exercise, you know experiment you know when they uh -huh. do project but actually gps we need outdoor uh, to get the gps signal so a lot of uh, uh, beginner uh, did that mistake la. so just mm -hmm. to highlight that you actually need to put the gps at least the antenna <laughs> the and, antenna, and the antenna is outside <laughs> outside uh. right. so even if, if we are in the car you know for, for example when we, we open the google map or waze right Mm -hmm. So if you in the car, your phone might sometime might not get the signal also. Mm -hmm. Sometimes if okay. your you know the, your window is tinted, uh, oh, the okay, tint, okay, okay. tinted material is actually uh, parts of it is iron also, metal. Metal. So, ah, oh. so, so it has effect eh, on the signal. Eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So sometimes oh. if you open 
you you lower down your your window, you get mm. uh, better signal. Better signal. Oh, I didn't know that. <laughs> this is the way. So the yeah, yeah, yeah. tinted has effect also. Yeah, tinted have effect, especially those that reflect one. Mm -hmm. Reflect, reflect, reflect. one. Uh, it will reflect the signal also. Yeah. Right. So okay, these are the this is the product you can see. You will get this now. Basically, if you are buying this, you will get the Groove GPS module with the antenna. So these are the future. It supports uh. NMEA and U Block 6 protocol. It's a low power consumption. The batteries are configurable. It's a Groove UI interface and it's compatible with Arduino and Raspberry Pi. So you can always come here for uh, the product page to know more about this product. And at the bottom, as usual, we have the resources for you, for you to get started using this sensor and also to know more details about uh, this product. Okay, so let's move to the next product. Okay, this is the 0 0.91 inch 128 times 32 small. I2C OLED. Very right, tiny. So, uh, has it? Very, <laughs> very tiny. tiny. <laughs> very tiny. Zero point, just now it's what? 0 0.96 right, inch. Oh, very small. Very small. Maybe you can use and like one, 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 one line, right? If yeah, you are displaying uh, the... I think the, uh, that depends on the resolution. Oh, okay. Resolution. Okay. It's very small. Uh. Very small. Mm -hmm. So if you like to display some uh, tiny information and it's using I2C, so mm -hmm. it's very convenient. Uh. Right. Right. Yep. I think the product okay. page also have a demo, a video there to demo. Yeah, okay, so I, this is the I2C. product page. Oh, then we don't have the oh, okay yeah, we have the video here yeah and uh i just saw the spec is five five foot and 3.3 volt compatible so. it's compatible yeah so it's using yeah, the so driver you... is common driver ssd 1306 yeah, yeah it's very common oh, right. uh, do you know uh even raspberry pi oh, yeah. yeah right so that's you always can come to the product page to see the product and also to watch this video to see how how it's interface in a project all right okay so okay so okay that's about the 0 0.96 inch OLED. Nine one. So, 0 0.91 sorry, nine one. Nine one. Sorry, nine, nine six is the difference it's very right? small it looks even smaller <laughs> so then it's a 0 0.91 okay so the, the price for this product is 14 ringgit and 90 cents currently we are giving 20 percent off for this product as well so you can grab this for 11 ringgit and 90 cents and on top of that uh, you can apply the NPI code as well, discount code as well. So for the first 10 early birds, you can have a on top uh, additional discount on top of this 20%. And okay, this offer will, uh, it will end in 11 more days and we have 99 in stock. So try to grab it and if you, if you want to try it, you want to explore this uh, OLED and install in your next upcoming projects. Project. Right. So let's move to the next product. This is the DIY STEM walking back your service <laughs> why it's a wired controllable but rock your service <laughs> so i have the the kit over here oh okay. it over has the kit yeah, nice. yeah. so yeah, we, we also include the battery oh, no. double a battery so don't worry about the double a battery you just you just buy the whole kit then have fun with it oh there's a video teaching you and there's also manual teaching you so you can download it. So uh, th this is from uh, one of our staff. Uh. It's very nice. You know, you, you, you create something that can move. Move. Uh, I mean, not, not, not like rigid, right? Something have the movement. Yeah. Uh, it's always nice to see that. So no, do, do it with, with kids. Uh, because they like something, they, they build something, then that thing can actually work. Would. It's very satisfying. Uh, satisfying. Mm -hmm. So this is for this is for children under not suitable for children under yeah, four maybe. years. Uh. Uh, some of the that, screws, uh, you know, uh -huh. some of the small screws. Uh. But it can be done eh? Super, with the parents' supervision will be okay. Uh. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean for four years we want to do then the parents are there, should be okay. So this is uh so it's actually for kids uh, basically. So kids will love it. But I, uh, I, I not only for kids, even I, I myself I built a few for uh, together with my daughter. 
Oh, yeah. yeah, I like to build this. Really? <laughs> right, so these are the items you will get when you purchase uh, this uh, stamp kit. Actually, you, you get the battery, the controller, the motor, and also the oh. parts as well. I like this one because it can, it, we can control the movement. Movement, ah. Uh, no, there's a remote control remote there. Control. Of course, it's not wireless, uh, it's wired, right. but you can control it to move forward, backward. This is like the old days, right? Old days we have this wired kind of yeah, yeah the car, the car. The car. The car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Simple car, right? Yeah. Yeah. Right. So the manual are here. You can always come here for resources. You in a PDF format. So you can always come here to download the uh, manuals. So that's about the DIY. Now, this is another okay. The price, sorry, the price for this product is 14 ringgit. And currently we are giving 20% off as well for this product. And you can grab this uh at 11 ringgit and 20 cents and on top of that you can always apply the npi code discount as well at the bottom of the uh, uh with live here you can see the code there you can grab the code and apply here so let's move to the next product which is a stamp kit as well uh a different dinosaur actually this is a tri tri this one yeah so these are this the one. Uh, the back and also it comes with batteries so four pieces of uh, double a battery so in case you 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 power it up <laughs> then <laughs> you play until there's no battery you battery. still have one set one. <laughs> <laughs> but it requires two batteries you need to operate battery, uh, yeah but we need four, four. Yeah. Right. okay so that's about the stem kit okay, we have viewers uh muhammad fishal so hi Hi, hi, hi. Oh, this is Chegu, ni MOE. Chegu, oh, oh okay. I need account Chegu. Yeah. <laughs> Normally, oh. this is a uh, teacher account. Okay, okay. Yeah. Chegu, Chegu. Okay, so that's about the product. So the price for this product is 14 ringgit and 50 cents. And currently, we are giving 20% off for this product as well. So you can grab this for 11 ringgit and 60 cents. And on top of that, you can always apply the NPI code. The NPI code is on the bottom there. It's a running uh, uh, running wording there. So you can always grab the code, the NPI code, and apply uh, at the checkout. So you can enjoy an uh, additional discount on top of this. So let's move to the next product. Uh, this is an interesting product. <laughs> it's a 3D printer, actually. So this is a Creality Ender 2 Pro 3D printer. So it's a new printer right so mm, it's a yeah. more smaller size okay so there are eight advantage of this printer actually so it's a four step assembly because it's 90 percent pre-installed already it's easy operations uh, user-friendly design light and portable uh do you diy refit oh so you have some other things you can DIY and clip on screen, uh, simplify installation and dismantling, reinforce Z axis design, steady and stable, and a compact toolkit, convenient and streamlined storage. Okay, so this is the Creality Ender 2 Pro. So Pro. you can come here, Ender 2 Pro. So it looks very compact, huh, over the, the, the design yeah, yeah, yeah. itself. Design. Yeah, yeah. If, you, like, if any any anyone of you know Prusa like Prusa Mini? Prusa, yeah, like yeah, 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 yeah. So Prusa, the, yeah. the design follow uh, this kind of you know what, what they call it. You know, it's not uh, it's still FDM, but there's no gantry. Uh. Gantry. Oh, okay. The the other like the the L shape is not there uh, something. Yeah, yeah. I, I can't remember what what kind of structure is there already. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But this, this is uh, similar to Prusa. Prusa. Yeah. But it's not easy to carry also, eh? the, the, the hook for you. Yeah, there, there's, a handle. <laughs> handle there's a handle. Handle <laughs> there. And it really is four step only. So compared to, for example, the older machine, Ender 3, Ender 3 V2, mm -hmm. uh, if you look at the assembly step, there, there are more than 20, I think. But this is only 20. four step. Four step. Uh, so basically, you just install the, the Z axis, uh -huh. the Z axis from the bottom, the screw from the bottom. Then oh. also the the LCD at the side, LCD. you click it, you clip it, <laughs> then the spool holder. That's all. Oh, that's why it's four step only. <laughs> four step. <laughs> so it's, it's it's literally four step only, and no, no, nothing more required. Yeah. yeah. Oh, 
Okay, so it's like for, I mean, and the, so, so yeah, the printing quality is quite good. Yeah, it's very uh, up to par. La, I would say up, up to, to par. par. Yeah. Oh, it's like it's it's four point six five kilo only. So I think it's not 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 that yeah. heavy. Yeah. It's, okay, it's yeah. lighter than you know the five kg rice pack. Yeah, yeah, five kg. <laughs> <laughs> all right so oh as mentioned yeah like you mentioned over the steps yeah i mean the handle yeah the exact axis first so even the screw they, they also show it to you, you know, how many yeah. screw only <laughs> <Not one. laughs> very very easy yeah, to set up very easy very easy yeah. oh this is so the one like, yeah I mean, it, it compared, you know, if you compare to Ender 3, Ender 3 V2, the, definitely this is much more easier. La, right? Much more easier, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because Ender 3, I, I experienced Ender 3 with me, but it's quite, it takes some time also. La. It's not like as easy yeah. as mentioned here. La. This yeah, one yeah. is more easy. But of course, it's one time only, right? One time only. Ah, it's one time, one time only. Yeah. Uh, but I mean, if you, if you like like doing like working with the machines, then Ender 3 is good experience also. La. I mean, yeah, yeah, you definitely. Get the, Ender 3, yeah, you, you learn a lot. Ender but, 3. Uh, <laughs> yeah. And of course, the price is cheaper also, like Ender 3. Uh, I think this, is, yeah. later we talk about it, the price. Uh, sure. I, I cannot remember the price. Eh. Okay, so these are the things about, about the Ender 2 Pro. So you can always come to the resource page and to know more and to see if this printer is something you are, I mean, if you are some. If you're looking for a printer, 3D printer, and which is very easy, like less, less, I mean, less hurdle hustle. for you. Hustle, hustle, hustle. Less hustle. Less hustle. Less hustle. <laughs> so you can, you can join our group. group. Yeah, you can join our group there at the uh, bottom, the, the QR code, Telegram group. Yeah, Telegram group. You can always come yeah. join our group. So this group we, is... It's very active. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like every day, every day there's an uh, idea question, they're sharing, you know, someone print this, print that, and uh -huh. take some video, and then help to troubleshoot. troubleshoot. So it's very, very active. Uh. I okay. like it. Yeah. So you can always join this group. I mean, if you have any doubts or any question, or you want to know what printer, you can always post your question there. Then there'll be some of the members there. Yeah. Be some of the active member, uh. active members. Not necessary, uh, you know. <laughs> I think not, not necessarily us, right? Yeah, yeah, not not us. Us. yeah. So it's actually a community, la. It's not yeah, from Cytron right. also. We just you know gather everyone uh, mm -hmm. uh, to be inside the group. Oh, but the, the price is very attractive. Yes, I mean it's the opposite really? for nine. <laughs> the actual price is seven one nine, but now we are giving the ten percent off, so you can grab this for six four nine. It's very attractive, and you can apply really? the NPI yeah. code as well. So you yeah, to get, get more, extra right. Uh, Extra yeah. discount. So oh, we have is, currently eight, eight in stock. So and the offer will end in three more days. So if you are looking for new 3D printer with less hassle, so this is the 3D printer for you. So try to grab this before the offer ends. Also, if it's if before it's gone, because I believe yep. most of the new newbies for the 3D printer would love may want to explore. You can use this if you are just trying to have fun or making a small small printed stuff. Right, I, so yeah. I just I, noticed yes, okay. CD just joined the Telegram group, the 3D printing. Oh, Telegram group. Yeah. Good. <laughs> Thanks, CD. <laughs> right, so we have a viewer here, Ahmad No Kade. Senang lah, betul. Memang senang pasang. It's easy Memang to assemble. Senang. Senang. Lah. Ini dulu saya cakap, ah, tutup satu belah mata <laughs> pun boleh pasang. <laughs> kan? Betul, betul. <laughs> Jangan tutup dua belah, tutup sebelah. <laughs> Okay, so that's about uh, Clarity Ender 2 Pro 3D printer. Let's move to the next product. Okay, this is a 3D printer oh. as well. This is an Ender 3 S1. It's a direct drive 3D printer. Okay, usually yeah, we don't have this. Right? Yeah. This is a direct drive. We don't have. Yep. Okay, uh, so the Snapmaker is direct drive, actually. Snapmaker. Oh, snap oh, yeah. yeah. Snap that is high end. Uh, that's high end. <laughs> <laughs> but usually for the normal FDM, we don't have the direct drive right you need to upgrade no, by your... we don't have i think site site uh there's a uh, there's one uh artillery i think site winder oh okay, site okay, winder. okay. yeah yeah site uh, that, that one is direct drive direct drive let me check i think ahmad no say pejam mata pun boleh pasang betul <laughs> uh... <laughs> 
Lain kali you kena tunjuk uh, tanggap tanggap video. <laughs> Okay, so you can come to this page. Uh, I mean, this is the it's a new 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 printer uh, from the Creality, uh, and the three S1 direct drive. Because usually for direct drive, we need to upgrade by our own. Uh, I mean, if you're getting a yeah, Creality yeah. with a with a not the high end one, uh, but this one comes with the uh, comes with the uh, direct drive, and also it's equipped with the CR Touch, CR Touch yeah. accurate level. Because so you, you have the the auto bed leveling, auto leveling. Yeah. yeah because usually bed bed leveling is the most most important thing uh. <laughs> yeah, most thing. important then most tedious also uh, sometimes right yeah is if for beginners sometimes they cannot they cannot get it right uh. yeah because once if your 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 the first layer is not right then the over one also will will spoil yeah. us all, uh. <laughs> yeah uh -huh. I think uh, one Muhammad Akil say ah uh, senang pasang. And uh, I think he's mentioning for the and that and the pro. pro just, uh, this yeah, this one is also quite quite easy because the gantry is uh, is done already. So I think oh, they they, they okay. also highlight the gantry is done already. So okay, so this is the product. Maybe later it's mentioned here. Okay, so this video here now you can always come here to see the video, uh, how how it's done. The installation process and this is a this this printer has won award eh? it's an expo uae selected for best seller national best for best i think in men, up here is mentioned oh no expo 2000 expo. dubai eh? in dubai in dubai in dubai okay so oh, i think they mentioned they're selected to exhibit eh? mm. I like to the exhibit okay so okay this this comes with quite uh like already upgrade usually these are the things we upgrade now the direct yeah. drive the auto bed leveling cr touch like yes I, yes i myself yeah. also i have this and the three the the old version so i just yeah. recently updated to the cr touch as well now. but uh. if you are getting this one so you don't need to think of upgrading it i mean you, you almost have almost have all the things in the printer already the cr touch the direct drive so you don't need to buy a different one. Uh, like Atira also mentioned the same thing. So no need, so no need VL touch. Yeah. So you don't need the VL touch. It already come installed, pre-installed already. So these are the spec actually. The, the, the a dual gear, sprite, dual gear, direct extruder. It's like a CR touch, automatic uh bed leveling. Are uh, using the silent board as well? Okay. So usually if you are buying the no, the older one has a quite a bit of noise. La. Quite a lot also that the noise but this one has a silent main board and this has a dual z axis yeah so it's not a single so you have two road on the two side right on the two side yeah supporting variety of filaments it support pla tpu ptg and abs it's a quick that, direct drive uh direct drive normally support a lot of uh, mm. uh different filament uh. so for example the our hours you know the the older one is bolden tube Wooden tube. Wooden tube. So, yeah. tube uh, TPU, TPU is difficult uh, for yeah. wooden tube. But there because TPU, no TPU usually get uh, when it's coming through the the no not, not the extruder right. It can get yeah. like so you get stuck right sometimes. Spaghetti. Yeah. Spaghetti. Yeah, yeah spaghetti. <laughs> yeah. And TPU normally is uh, very flexible. Uh. Sometimes oh, we call it uh, flex ninja. Ah, oh, flex flexible. Ninja, yeah. yeah. Uh, so it's very difficult for. Uh, the non-direct driver uh, non mm -hmm. okay so these are the spec you have the pc spring still print sheet and 4.3 inch lcd screen and practical preset interface so you can always come to the product page yeah it has a lot of uh, useful information this is the direct extruder basically and the auto bed leveling so 10 16 point precise leveling well four times four uh. Yeah. Very nice. Something similar to like, like Prusa, right? The, right? Something something like uh, Prusa, I think. Yeah, I Prusa, think so. Prusa, Prusa 16 also. Or yeah. I think so, I think so. Mm -hmm. So these are the features now of this uh printer. So you can always come here and you have budget for uh you're looking for a very not not a very high end, uh it's quite high end uh 3D printer. Yeah, and you yeah. have budget 
for this and you can always grab oh, this okay. the, you know, the assembly is quite simple also yeah oh this one is five five sets i think <laughs> just now it was four yeah, now five it's five sets, yeah <laughs> now the gantry is uh, done already most ah. of the time is the z uh no the x axis is not assembled yet so that that part is quite difficult for n3 mm -hmm. n3 v2 yeah. oh yes yeah so that the part if that part is done uh it's quite easy already. You save, I think, 10, 10 minutes of that. <laughs> 10 minutes. So it's pretty much easy as So yeah, you can, yeah, yeah. like, you have like five, I think, oh, sorry, six. Six, six. steps. Uh, six steps to get this printer assembled and uh, ready for. Oh, it, it also comes with a filament run out uh, sensor at the top there. This one, right? This one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, this one. Oh, yeah. this is good like, if you are if you are running your print print uh, the printing is running for long hours and you want to yeah. leave it so the filament sensor it always will be necessary like. yeah, yeah and, and uh, sometimes if in case your filament you know after long time it can break easily oh, so yeah. it actually it, it, it will not just you know the nozzle just going round and round round, round uh -huh. without any filament okay. <laughs> so if you see the big yeah. air gap there <laughs> yeah you waste so, time you waste the energy to you know to heat up the extruder nice, so yeah. it, without the filament it will stop like, your pause uh -huh. yeah. so it's a, it's a good good land to have the filaments it, it yeah, comes yeah. together so you can always grab this printer so here i mentioned some of the creative potential you can use this how you can use this printer and okay so these are a, a more details detail about the product basically so these are the recommended accessories the, these are product uh respect respect okay so you can always come to the product page you can uh to know more about the product so it's quite detailed in our product page here about this printer so you can always grab here and don't forget to join our Telegram group as well. So if you want yeah. to have any question regarding the 3D printer or 3D printing. And the price for this product is uh, 1,659 ringgit. And currently we are giving 4% off for this product. So you can grab this for 1,599 ringgit. And on top of that, you can still apply the NPI code as well for this. So you can get an additional discount. And you have a budget for this print uh additional budget you can always look for this printer so this quite a uh, high-end printer so you have the direct drive and the cr touch so nothing much you can stay i mean the installation steps are easy so you can get it assembled and run it as soon as you receive the product i think so that's about the quality and the three s1 direct drive as 3d printer so let's move to the next product we have another two more after this you have two more product to go so try to cover it up so this is a 3D printer as well. So this is the Creality Sir Moon. Sir Moon. Sir Moon. Sir Moon. Sir Moon. V1 Pro, Pro Direct Drive 3D oh, Printer. Direct Drive. I think the trend is towards Direct Drive. Direct Drive. <laughs> I think so this one is pre assembler uh. This one nice is pre assembler Just already. you can use it just, just out of the box. It, <laughs> you can use it. Just power, use uh, of it. course. <laughs> But this one look, looks 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 nice, eh? The yeah. printer. Oh, so this is like more like you have the, the it comes with the enclosure and everything, so yeah. you can put it in a in a room. You don't no need to worry about the noise kids. or the, the kids. Uh, kids. <laughs> yeah, but, yeah. Because the when the printer, the printer definitely is hot. I mean, sometimes it worries. Yeah, uh. yeah, like my room also worries me. Sometimes my kids cut want to come and see me then the printer is running they want to touch the bed <laughs> uh, so no that let them touch no one for me they know only <laughs> once the bed is still still okay right uh yeah the bed, the bed the still, okay, still okay still okay yeah the nozzle correct so this is the okay like it's a print out of box so as you can see in the picture so this is a printer you can just like just uh, take it out of the box then you can start to print yeah start okay, using so it that's quite uh, some features here so these are the remote uh, printing and monitoring so it use the creality cloud app oh. to remotely operate and print so you don't need to be to be what to be physically in front of the machine uh, to so you can send the file through the cloud and you can control the machine over the cloud 
it has a silent printing it has an automatic fit and return it's a smart one button and it's fully enclosed uh chassis so you can see it's a fully enclosed chassis so you don't need to worry about i mean uh about get, get it dusty or like maybe the uh, order also no order uh, yeah the order so it's an enclosed order. fully it has uh fully enclosed it's an intelligent door so it's sensors, a main uh. sensors uh, yeah. close i mean the printer will st uh, pause now if that you open the door and if you close it down then it will uh resume back now. it's a quick uh disassembly platform uh sprite direct uh, using the sprite direct drive as the previous printer just now we see just now uh mm. it's, i think uh, like you said over oh, uh, they are moving through that now to direct drive uh, using the sprite yeah. direct drive so you there are video here uh videos are there so you can always come and see how this thing. this one is more likely if you're if you want to introduce a 3d printer for your kids and yeah for kids and, and you you uh kids uh, yeah. for kids basically this is easier for them to hand they, they can handle them by themselves also uh, because yeah. uh but definitely you need a uh, parent supervision but it's, it's the kids will be able to handle the 3d printer as well so these are the uh some of the uh info on the printer so how to disassemble disassemble and assemble and about the flexible the uh the, the red, uh flexible metal is using the magnetic uh bed uh it's a smart control on the palm the wi-fi connection remote printing wide angle camera oh is that it comes with the camera for real time the pro, quite good. The pro. Oh, okay. is the pro i think is pro, pro i think ours is pro yeah it's mentioned for pro i think pro it just go to uh, first so these yeah, are the details of this of this product uh, basically so you can always come here our product page are quite detailed here so if you have need any info you can always come to the product page and view and there's a video here how the printing is done how the for the first time the unboxing and all so you can always come to our product page and get it view here and the price for this product is 1825 ringgit and currently we are giving seven percent off for this product and you can grab this for 1699 ringgit and on top of this you can apply the npi code as well to get uh, additional discount and this printer if you're thinking of getting a printer and you have budget for your kit so definitely this printer would be your first choice i, I would say this is a first choice because for the price and what you're getting is quite good so yeah. you can always try to grab this printer we have five in stock so the offer ends in three more days and try to grab this before the offer are gone so we are a bit uh extending the we have two more products before we end our session for today just bear with us sorry for this one all right so the next product is the lora 923 lora 923 megahertz fiberglass 200 this is uh, similar to the one we we introduced we the, other day. Uh, the other day the other day is 7 dbi Oh, yeah, seven uh, DBI, this, seven DBI. This one we launched it uh, last week. Uh, uh, look at looking at the days. Uh, you know, ex, mm -hmm. uh, the offer expired offer in six days, so we actually launched it last week, and it's out of stock already. <laughs> <laughs> this are a hot product. <laughs> this one is, uh, but it's two meter. Uh, even even their stock is very difficult for us to show you guys. Uh, because mm -hmm. the two hundred cm is two meter length. You know, just imagine it's taller than us. <laughs> <laughs> it might be the same as the door height, two meters. <laughs> two meters. Yeah. Okay, so uh, this is nine dbi and uh, high gain, high gain antenna. Uh, so, so for those that use for, uh, Lola, uh, what helium, mm -hmm. long feel, uh, what else Lola when the things that work, uh, anything between uh, uh, uh around nine hundred megahertz frequency. Uh, Mm -hmm. uh, you can use it so uh but this is not a active antenna this is passive but passive. high gain yeah high gain and then, yeah right so that's about the product we have seen this product uh last time in our previous so it's similar yeah. just the 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 length the, uh, the length and, and the, also the gain the, the gain is uh different so like over has mentioned if you're thinking i mean once you are restocked or you want to get this always think of the safety as well try to grab the antenna lightning arrester as well for yep. this all right so currently the item is out of stock so just click that if you're interested you may click the notify me button so you'll be notified once the item is restocked so yep. 
So we have come to the last product for today. Last product is now. This is a box. Very interesting. This is expensive. Many people have been looking for this product. Yeah, oh. it says C reality CR scan zero one. Let me see if I can scanner. open. Oh, okay. It hasn't sealed it, See. so I might be able to open. So it's a three D scanner actually. So yeah, I think from reality. Oh. reality. Oh, there's James Bond back. <laughs> Looks cool, very nice back. <laughs> what? What like doing... hard, hard case? Ah, uh? hard like. Hard case. Hard case. Oh, hard case. Oh, okay, okay. Arcade, oh, but okay, it's okay. fabric, fabric, uh. fabric, uh, fabric. Uh. Fabric. Uh, let me see. Oh, there's a zip also. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Very nice. So, uh, the, let me show. Uh, just need to be careful. Ah, so this is a scanner. Oh, okay. okay. The scanner, the tripod. Oh, you can see the tripod, tripod also. For it. Oh, tripod okay. For it. Very nice tripod. It's not plastic, it's metal. Metal. Uh, uh, this is a round table, rotating table. Oh, we put the product there, then it will... Uh, you oh, put the product okay. then, it rotate, you scan rotate. it. So instead of you going around it... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Then some power supply. Mm -hmm. Power adapter with uh, universal... Uh, conductor, plug. a previous supply. Connector. Yeah. And cables. Uh. Oh. And cables. Uh, for you to yeah. connect to the to the three D scanner and also mm. to the computer. Mm. And so also to the it. power. Yeah. That's all. Mm -hmm. three D oh. scanner is always cool, eh? I mean, I mean, I mean, if you can like scan a three D the product, you can scan it. And then you bring it to the PC, then it looks really Yeah, you can print it. No, then you, you can print it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you add it. Oh, there's uh, another, uh, again, bigger, bigger size of the plate. The plate, the plate. Ah, yeah, the plate. Okay. And of course, the manual. The manual. All right. The manual. So that's all. Very nice yeah. uh, because yeah. it's, it comes with this bag. You can actually keep it after you use it. Is it? So it's not. It's not like 3D printer. <laughs> Would it <laughs> become dusty and everything? Uh, become dusty. Eh? <laughs> right, so... It's nice. It's nice. Mm -hmm. yep. So the one, the one we are having is a scanner premium combo set. Nah. It's a premium combo set actually. Yep. So because like, scanning is always cool. Nah. For, me, for, me, for me, I feel like it's quite cool. I mean, you can scan a product, then you can come print again the same product. <laughs> So yeah, it's like yeah. Very, very, it looks very cool. And these are the specs. So, and also, oh, you, so you need to change. Oh, oops. Oh, okay. You need to change. Okay. Okay. So, these are the specs. So, the main features are it's a fast scanning, high precision, automatic data processing. It has multiple languages. It supports multiple languages. Uh, true color. And it can be, it has few modes actually. You can use it as a handheld mode. You want to use it with your hand and scan it. Or you want to use it as an automatic multi post alignment and also a turntable mode. Or is that you have three different modes now, basically? So you can decide what you how you want to do it. But this one is quite cool. I mean, this clearly has come up with their own scanner now, CR scanner. Yeah. So here in the product page, is mentioned like, how, how it's done, how you can scan the product. It's flexible and portable. It's, then, it's how turn turntable mode. Uh, 360 degree rotating scan, high precision. Or oh, for large object objects, you can use your hand. Uh, basically, I think, yeah, in a handheld mode, you can scan it. So it's quite interesting. So you can always come to the product page and uh, to know more about this one, to learn more about this product. Okay, so it's a uh, plenty of uh, details are here. Uh, so you can use it for education, for medical, for e-commerce, cultural relics, clothes, industry, and these are the spec product. These are. Uh, Color depth sensor, flash lamp, and also a projector. Right. The so these are the things. The list. Right? Yeah. Uh, list of items you will get now uh, inside the box. You get the scanner, you get the tripod, uh, turntable. Uh, this is the one uh, Obert showed just now. The bigger turntable, the power plate. cord, uh, plate. The the plate, the power cord. You get the turntable control cable. Uh, you have the data cable. It comes with the eight GB USB drive and also the carry case. And 
Oh, this one, you can print it also. Lah. Use the printer. Okay. This for handheld. Some notes are here. And right, so that's about the scanner. So this is how it look like lah, once you open yep. your box. So the price for this product is uh, 2,790 ringgit. Uh, currently, we are giving Ooh. 10 or 10 10%. Quite, quite, 10 percent, quite a lot. <laughs> Oh, it's quite a lot. You are told a bit. You are told a bit. It's 200 something. <laughs> so the price, the current, you can, with the 10% discount, you can grab this for 2,511 ringgit. And on top of that, you can still apply the NPI code for this. Uh, you can enjoy an additional discount. So we have five in stock currently, and this offer will end in eight more, day, eight more days. So if you're into 3D printing and you want to explore the 3D scanner, so it'll be a great op uh, opportunity for you to grab this and explore the uh, 3D scanning. So I think with this, we have come to an end for our NBI MPI for, for today. So this for this week, yeah. So thank you for all the viewers and all the comments. So thank, sorry for taking 11 minutes more from our usual time. We have passed. <laughs> Perfect, actually. <laughs> but it's okay. Ho hopefully, all the viewers enjoy what we have introduced today yeah. and try to grab the products. Now. Basically, the discounts all are, we are giving so that the makers out there can have a chance to explore the new products. And on, on top of that, we are giving the NPI discount as well at the bottom. You can grab the coupon code, the NPI coupon code as well. So try to use it because the, there's validity for the coupon code as well. So if you are the first 10 early birds, then you can enjoy a additional discount on top of the NPI discount we are giving. So that's all for today from me and over. So yeah. until then, we shall meet in the next, in the next upcoming NPI with a new product. Okay, until then, bye-bye and stay safe. Okay, bye. Bye-bye.